Look, I, I think one of the most important places to begin when thinking about publishing the arts is, is to think about the, the different disciplinary configurations of arts. Now, in a lot of arts areas, um, books and book chapters have been more important than mm -hmm. have been journal articles. Now, that is actually changing, but it's changing quite slowly. Another thing that is characteristic of arts that's important is that it's, by and large, unlike the social sciences broadly conceived, the, there hasn't been the same level of co-authorship. Right. So, yes. so one of the consequences of that for the person who is doing arts and is coming in as an early career researcher or as a research high degree student publishing, is by and large they're publishing by themselves. Yes. And they're therefore getting assistance usually from their supervisor or from their friends mm. um, in, in orienting what they're doing to, to the field more generally. Now this, this means, of course, that the, um, the, the arts person tends to be more, um, not alone in the activity, but, but mm. they're, they're, they're more having to work out themselves where, where things are best located and, and so on. Mm. Um, now, obviously, the books and book chapters and, and that precedence yes. actually is related to the journal articles in particular ways in that a lot of the invitations to become part of books, to write book chapters, and even to write on a particular topic actually comes from the journal publishing. So, so there's, there is this relationship you have to be aware of.